Today, we're reviewing this new pram slash stroller we got for our reborn dolls. Hi, dolly friends. This is Kitty. And I'm Tutty. And, and welcome, welcome to, to Little Bottle Nursery. Nursery. Our channel is dedicated to our love of dolls and we feature reborns, realistic dolls plus vintage dolls. So stick around and have some dolly fun. Hi everyone and welcome back to our channel. If you're new to our channel, we want to warmly welcome you and thank you for joining us. Hit the like button and subscribe if you like what you see, as it really helps us out. Now here is the Mama Kitties 2-in-1 Baby Stroller Pram Jogger Push Chair. Wow, what a mouthful. <laughs> We found this pram online and what we really liked about the pram is that it's lightweight and it's reversible. So you can have the reborn facing you and it's suitable from newborn up to three years. So this will act this pram and slash stroller will actually work for our toddler reborns as well. Here are some of the specifications for the pram slash stroller. As you can see, you can have it forward facing or in reverse. And there's various other features to do with the foot brake and folding, etc. We purchased this pram from a company called My Moon Mart. I'll leave the link in the description. And the best part of it was that it was on sale for half price. So we only paid $199 for it. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to get the pram out of the box now. So let's get started. Oh, how exciting! Here it is out of the box. Now I'm going to attempt to put it together. Wish me luck. <laughs> so I'm back. That didn't take nearly as long as what I thought it was going to. It was really intuitive to put together. I hardly needed the instructions. Everything just clipped into place super duper easy. So let's go through some of the features. There's the brake down here, which can be accessed by just pushing the red piece down and lifting up when you want to release the brake. At the back here, there's a vent to put air in during summer. So I've set this pram slash stroller up uh, in reverse so that the reborns can face us. Can see inside this this piece can lift off here um, this was an extra piece an extra lining piece in here there's clips to make it look more realistic especially when you've got a toddler in the pram so I think what I'll do now is I'm going to show some examples of our reborns in our new pram so here's our little reborn Saskia this is Matilda May and she's in she's lying in the bassinet so I'm just going to pull that up the visor so you could actually take this reborn out and it would look quite realistic and if you were self-conscious then this would be the way to go is to start off with the bassinet because that really hides the baby and you could even pop like a Muslim wrap or even a, a blanket down here if you were really super self-conscious the first time you were taking your reborn out for a walk but that's so snuggly it's um, the end of autumn here in Australia so that's why I've used woolly type blankets in summer we would use uh, a very sheer Muslim cloth instead so let's try a toddler doll now. So it was super easy to turn this into a stroller. I just tightened this strap, popped the excess in there. And down below, there's another strap here, which I adjusted. 
and so that has pulled it into a stroller reverse facing so I'll just get a toddler in now here's Freya Noel she's our Tibby sculpt by Donna Rubin and she she's a big girl she's chunky and she fits beautifully in this stroller I love this massive storage compartment underneath that is super handy for holding things we are going to have so much fun taking our toddlers and our reborn babies out in this stroller slash pram absolutely love it so I definitely recommend this pram it was very affordable it's light and, and it's easy to use it was so easy to set up and I'm sure it's I'm going to close it up very shortly I'm sure that's going to be very easy as well so stay tuned for our first reborn outing in our pram that's coming up very very soon and I'd like to thank everyone for watching today please like comment and subscribe to see more of our dolly content and if we don't see you during the week, we'll see you on Sunday. Bye, everyone.